Uh, welcome to my blind playthrough of 507 Rebirth. Uh, yes, I've just completed the Gungaga reactor in the last one. And now it's time to do some exploring and side questing. So that's what I'm doing for, for a little while now. Hopefully it's going to be too boring here. Say, can you spare a minute? Not really. You know that weird black stuff coming out of the reactor? Well, the wind seems to be carrying it all the way over here. I'll admit my shack's never been in the best condition. But look at it. Holes everywhere. Holes so big that would you believe it? All my chickens flew the coop. I plugged up the holes, but beyond that, I'm at wit's end here, let me tell you. Flapping and running around like crazy. How's an old woman like me supposed to catch them all? I can't keep up with a flock Gotta of Gotta catch chickens. them all. <laughs> oh, it's chickens. terrible. All but these two got away. Peepy -pee and Peep are so easygoing. They stay <laughs> right here with me without any urging. But Eppley and Pippity and Pippy and Peep, well, they didn't hesitate. Took off like nice, lightning. Nice. We don't usually see anything like that around these parts. From that black stuff to those bizarre aeroplanes. I tell you, all this craziness is enough to drive a poor woman mad. <laughs> the peace and quiet was the only good thing about this place. <laughs> only good thing? So we just need to catch your chickens, right? Oh, thank you, dearie. Let's go catch some chickens. He'd love the sound of this here clanger. Use it and they'll come out from wherever they're hiding and follow you right back to the coop. My nose should serve us well here. Right. Take it away. <laughs> I wonder if they're actually in town or if they... Three of them are still in the village. We should start by searching the surrounding area. Three of them are still in the village. Huh. I not quite see that used up. Also feed the climber to lure the missing chickens back to Carson. <laughs> Alright. There. Alright. Oh, okay. I got to go away. And feed climber. Alright. Try that again, shall we? I'll do the pull. Try not getting it too far away from it. Either, I guess. Duh. There you are, Pippity. You came back to your mommy. <laughs> Pippity. I oh, actually can tell the difference between them. Follow red for more chickens. Sure thing, sure thing. Alright, that's that one. No. Yeah, Over one. there. You can get distracted, stop moving, and wait for it to focus. Okay. Stop running, would ya? Darn it. Chicken. Oh! Gosh darn it, really? Or if we can throw it out here again, or if it still loses interest, or if it doesn't gain interest if I do this here. I need to get closer, or I need to like, get all the way back. Oh, there we go. Better. Ooh. 
Notice the howling stopped. Wonder what changed. Whoa, 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 whoa. Ah. Charge a feet liner, press out to yank it back just in time. Clean the string and roll along. Oh, okay. not a real cat. Am I right? So what are you then? I'm Kate Sick. Fortune teller extraordinaire. Oh. 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 Okay. Okay. To top up the old a little too early, I guess. Here. That's the charging. Seriously, let me move. Whoa. I was going to charge there, so I wasn't. Right outside. Pete, oh, there we are. I Take was it. so worried about you. That just leaves Pippany. Goodness me. How far could she have gone? <laughs> Pippany ran off toward the airfield. We must find her before the fiends do. We must find her. Right. Sounds so grave. My, my, what right. a trek you must have made to get here. Right, we tracked. Tracked and tracked and tracked. So I need to save it from some fiends then. I'm supposed to go here as well. So, what are free flyer pilots exactly? Well, since the Republic's on the strap heap, Shenra all but owns the skies. Birds ought to count their blessings that Shinra hasn't come down on them yet. Free flyers couldn't they care less though, and go wherever they please. Good for them. Nobody owns the sky, least of all Shinra. That our man gives him the finger as he flies by. For real? Sounds like my kind of guy. Alright, let's keep moving. Where is there's the chicken? It's a long way back to town. Careful now. Really, I have to do this all the way back? Right? It's fine. This one has any, like, other tricks up its sleeve. Wait, wait. Far away, I guess. Can't get too far ahead. It's gonna take forever to get back with this here, little birdie. Do it. Come on! Too bad. 
grows pressured over time with while storing electric energy. Once full charged, will counterattack and unleash 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 stun attacks. Busy? Cool. One more shot. Why don't you lead the Take way? The lead. Let me it's on you. My turn <laughs> now. Ready? <laughs> That's it. Come on. I got you. Beat them. <laughs> Tell the one of the one. <laughs> Just to escort you back. Hey! You needn't worry. Their newfound fear of the outside world <laughs> has driven them home with all haste. You <laughs> eat chicken? More or less. They were quite eager to return to the village. Kazra must take excellent care of them. We should go too. Oh, I'm not surprised. Mountain Park. Did I was I able to make one of those in Dino? I think so, right? No. Nice. Let's make one of these now then. Five sweet, sweet slots. At least for like when you play the game first time, it's very nice to have a lot of slots, in my opinion, at least. I mean, just being able to level up as many materials as possible, as quickly as possible. Oh. Ah. I do. Oh well. So you can get that one marked. Well, that was annoying that I managed to somehow, or somehow, but I managed to unequip my stuff. What did I have here? Um, yeah, let's put on a TV stagger and also a position defense. I think she had right. No, maybe not. Put on a steadfast block instead. The two, and then we have what else we got. As quickly as I can. I'm assuming I will get more elementals eventually, but I have it yet. There are none of these, no, no more of these that I need to equip, right? Auto cost, but those, I mean, those don't, don't really feel that good. <laughs> Might as well just use them myself, to be honest. This is like free, which I doesn't doesn't seem to be. That's not my the, my the feeling I get from that at least. Um, let's head back. Back into town. More with the chocobo in a bit here after I'm actually actually done with the 
exploring this place here. Standing in here or was he standing up? Oh! Should have been up there. Oh well. And that's probably where I need to go as well. Things for that second quest. How did I get up there now then? That's alright, that's the other exit. Other exit. Was right here? Let's get started with some no. practice swings. There it is. Wait. Why? Seriously. Uh -huh. I think I know now, but we'll see. No? Let's try it out. Oh, there it is, right. This is the path I wanted to take. Should have actually gone. Oh. This guy here. Um, since you're here, I need your help to become a true warrior. Please guide me to greatness. <laughs> I'm so Tetsu, by the way, with the GYC. Captain's been singing your praises, you know, telling everyone how you turned some state of the art Shinra weaponry into scrap metal. Oh, so you heard about all that? Well, I don't want to brag or anything, but we crushed him. Really? You have to teach me how you did that. Gotta make Zack proud. Have to? You know? Zack? He's a friend of mine. We grew up together, hung out and stuff. Haven't heard from him since he left the village, though. But I'm sure a soldier like him's pretty busy. We may not be at war, but I bet they've got him traveling all over. You bet. To protect the village, of course. We're seeing more monsters these days, and I want to do my part. And, you know, it might also be kind of cool if everyone in the coalition called me a hero and the captain gave me a promotion. <laughs> or something like that. No can do. What? What? Sorry, no can do. We're just passing through. Please, I'm begging you. Huh? Wait. Me? <laughs> I knew as soon as I saw your throwing star. From That's the moment soft, I laid eyes on you and your weapon, I just had to make you my teacher. Please, train me in your warrior ways. <laughs> oh, I don't know. Well, since you're such a huge fan, one or two orbs might be enough compensation for my time. You sure you're up for the challenge? Of course. I'll do anything. <sighs> Sweet music to my ears. Okay, new disciple, meet me over there when you're ready. For pain. Don't worry. I am more than ready to receive your wisdom. <laughs> hey! Come along. See what you can learn, my second disciple. <laughs> uh, right. Not particularly fast. First and foremost, a ninja must have stamina. So let's see how much you've already got, shall we? After all, a ninja warrior must be able to make a tactical retreat back to her comrades when they need her. Understood, Master. <laughs> uh, sure. Let's Very begin well. training. Why not? And with that, let our training begin. I hope you're staying focused, my young disciple. Fiend. Please, teach me your ways, master. Strike the enemy three times, pressure and enemy, don't let such a fall in battle. Alright. Easy. Just, uh, I'm gonna need to just pressure them. Right, let's just do a wildfire. Oh, we can ice. And for them. Let's 
strike the freaking enemies, mate. Stagger an enemy. I get to do that again? Hey. Freeze master. Let me try again. Fine. We try. Kill them too quickly too. <laughs> now strike swift and true! Show me how it's Try. It's actually like stronger than like braver and stuff. It's just kind of crazy to be honest. First two ones was of course that did not too much damage basically, especially with uh, okay, let's keep up spell the spell blade. How many of these guys have to do? Any more, I guess. This is only your first step on the long and winding road to ninja hood. <laughs> Let 
Strike our enemies twice. Defeat all enemies within time limit. That's even following battle. So far, um, I think there's, or at least at least one more. So, if there's more than one more, it's just just one extra additional here, perhaps. Well, again, it's some harder enemy, maybe. We, we made it. <laughs> I hope you've got more in you, because that ain't gonna cut it. Right, I'm gonna take a quick look around. You rest up for the next round. I <laughs> <laughs> think you should focus on stamina, not strength. <laughs> yeah, Zack told me the same thing. He used to train here all the time. He called it his secret gym. Of course, it wasn't much of a secret since everyone knew about it. But it sounded cool. Hard to live up to the legacy of a guy like that. Check this out. It was his favorite <laughs> exercise. Her strength. A body. A mind. Start. By training. You're behind. It's <laughs> right. Like that. Gotta go deeper. Bend your knees more. Engage your glutes. In your quads. Got it. <laughs> Mate, you should be able to do some squats in a problem. Wherever he is, I hope he's doing good. You cramping up? Mayday! SOS! <laughs> <laughs> that's that's, like, that's actually look kind of dangerous. Let him fall in battle. Right. Start by assessing. Deal with that. Come on. I got your number. When they're not to weakness, will draw their ire and after some time in the past, they will be into rest and fuck them off damage while they're resting and pressure them. Hey, with ya! Fire them. It's your turn. Let's see. Okay. Let's see. This guy said, think. Let's do dive kick. Now, where is it all? Now, where is it all? We won? We actually won? Wow. All that training really paid off. Wait a second. Why should you help? That's it. I've got an idea. See you back at the village. Getting material from him shortly here. But first, 
Man, I head back and turn on those two quests. Because, yeah. Gaga region, Jugen Gaga village. Your stay with us. Yeah. Right. Indeed. Sure. I suspect there is more to Cisne than meets the eye. Say. It's the sea. Yeah, the sea is the combat simulator, right? Think a little bit about it. What's the material level 2? I suppose it's fine. Don't really want to do that right now. I think I'll explore it first and do all the battles at the same time. We're engaging that way. If there's anything else I can do for you, please let me know. I'm always happy to help. That's kind of fine. Thanks for offering though, I guess. They appear most pleased to be reunited with you in this place they call home. Thank you. They can be a handful, and chasing them really works up the appetite. <laughs> so allow me to whip you up some of Grandma Kazra's famous <laughs> grilled chicken. Say goodnight, Pippoli. <laughs> That was unexpected. I didn't quite um, see that coming to be honest. I don't think I've ever met such nice young people. Come back any time, you hear? Lucky Amulet. There's plenty more scrumptious grilled chicken where that came from. They... They could have lived long and happy lives running free. If I hadn't... Well... We all gotta eat. Oh! <laughs> all right. Well, that was a little hot. I I did not expect a grilled chicken chicken scene there. I have to admit, <laughs> that caught me by surprise. Uh, yeah. So we just talked it over, and we'd like to ask you to train all of us. In the art of combat, our coalition's only as good as its weakest member, so it only makes sense to get stronger together. We're really just passing through. <laughs> but you could rest here for a while. Hmm. Our services don't come cheap. It'll cost you a million gil. <laughs> That's a pretty steep price, but we could probably manage. Really? What? A million? Oh, and he forgot to mention materia. Preferably the precious kind. That we can't do. <sighs> Look, Sotetsu, they may be good at their jobs, but don't you think they're asking a bit much? We're looking for training, not trouble. <sighs> <laughs> if you're looking for someone to train you, then look no further. <sighs> no money or materia required. Well, thanks, Sisne. That'd be great. But what about the Turks after all? They're veterans of the battlefield and under their tutelage. What? My tutelage not good enough? In case you've <laughs> forgotten, I've seen my fair share of action. If all of you are serious about upping your game, I'll help you out. In fact, I've been meaning to offer for a while now. Seeing as we're here, well. Sounds good to me. Me too. Well, I thought it was a good idea. Sorry I wasn't able to convince the rest of them. It's just, I felt something when we first met. Almost like fate. And I guess I got a little carried away. Well, oh, don't sweat it. Then that settles it. Makes sense. Listen up. There's no backing out now, so be warned. I won't go easy. Roger! Roger. Cloud, Yuffie! I know you've got to make a living and all, but you might want to consider lowering your rates. <laughs> How considerate after you consider paying me? Where's my materia? Hey, we got a book, Three Yuffie. Or, or two. Two's good. Enough already. You're embarrassing yourself. Just one, dude. 
Oh, Yuffie. This is a Yuffie, I should say. Alright, so that's it for all the side quests around here. So, I mean, it's nice that there aren't that many side quests. There are a few, but it's, there's lots of other stuff to do, of course, with the whole... Uh, the whole... Uh, exploration and stuff. So I want to take, like, the path down towards the reactor that I... I failed to go up the path uh, in my in the last run, or when I was <laughs> running there with the girls, I went the wrong way at or I stopped I'm bouncing the mushroom or something. Like that. If we can get to any interesting locations, if we go buy a mushroom, it's one big bounce. Holy crap. Oh, got some material materials, but how do I get? To there, by the way. I want to go there as well. Alright, first of all, let's go up here and bounce on these mushrooms. Bounce the shrooms. Here's the bouncing location. Bouncy bouncy location. Let's take it, why not? Yeah. There we go, how long have I been here? Uh, maybe not actually. Let's bounce. I'm getting off the truck over here, just find it easier to explore like these kind of places without, uh, without being actually being on the truck over. Feels like to me anyway. Seems to get some high quality exploration this way. To the reactor, basically. I don't suppose I actually need to go in there, though. I think I could go that way somehow. I don't think so, anyway. Into the water and lose all the speed. Makes sense you can't run in the water, but it would only make, make more sense for it to, it to be a little bit of a break effect rather than just to basically complete stop. Just gonna check if I don't think I could go further here, I don't think so at least. I'm not entirely sure. It's unpassable territory. You know, I've said this several times already, but I do wish there was a clearer, like, uh, 
it's a clear separation of like the map where you can actually go. A fire, really. I'll go for that. I can get here somehow. Oh, if, like if I can, how I can actually get there. Assuming this will actually lead me to the reactor. To the, 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 the reactor. Can't go there. It seems like I cannot actually go that way. Let's move over. Might actually be it for this area here. Gungaga again. Where's Gungaga? This is what? It's good game, right? Explore anything north? I think so. North of the... North of, like, place. Okay, more, more quests? Let's try going there again. I think I thought I did all the quests. Like the maybe this seems like there's been an update. There's one more now. Welcome to Gungaga. Seems. Does this may have something for me? It looks it right. Spice of life. Checking happened. Watch your feet. <laughs> What am I gonna do about you? <gasps> wow, that's a smell. <laughs> we should go. Now. Wait, don't leave. Treat you guys to a bowl if you help with the ingredients. Uh, why is the kitchen looking like crime the scene? The pumpkin put up a fight. The knife I've got wasn't long enough to chop it in one clean go. Had to get stabby. And that bulbous bastard. The onion. I mean, I had to close my eyes while I cut it. But that might have been a bad call. I feel ya. What's in the pot? Gungaga mushroom soup. It smells pretty good all in all. Unfortunately, it's lacking in the flavor department. That's the problem. It needs something, but I'm not sure what. Maybe some more Gungaga mushrooms to do the trick. Or a hunk of cactuar meat. Hunk Let's of cactuar not. meat. <laughs> I will help. So, what more do you need? Hmm. Oh, right. Torgan's vegetables. That dog's probably parked near the village entrance, selling his produce. You mind swinging by and picking up some of this stuff for me? Uh, sure. <laughs> what a sweet boy you are, staying behind for me. You'll be good to Torgan now, you hear? My veggies. Did you just pay that dog money? Oh, him? That's Melon, Torgan's pup. He comes by from time to time to sell their farm's produce. We grow our own veggies here in town too, but the ones from Torgan's field are especially delicious. Come on, let's go after him. 
All right, follow Melon. If we could just fast travel to the farm, I'm done with it. Easy. There's my boy. How'd it go today? Good? Hello. Not seen you before. Out of towners? Just visiting, yeah. So could we buy some of your produce? Like standing in the background there. Can't help you. Don't sell to out of towners. Barely got enough for the locals as is. Judging by them duds you got on, you're city folk, ain't you? I ain't about to sell the bounty of my soil to young'uns who ain't never got down in the muck with me and mine. Now get. I don't know the first thing about farming, but I do know how happy these veggies are. Can practically hear them. <laughs> got an eye for the stuff, but you're telling me you got an ear too? What's this one saying? Something about how rich the soil is. How it can thrive and spread its roots deep, grow big and strong. I'll be. <laughs> oh, quit with the guilt tripping now, will ya? You know perfectly well I wasn't gonna leave them high and dry. We ain't seeing any more customers today, I reckon. So whatever we got left over is yours for the taking. <sighs> Thank you so much. We really appreciate it. Whatever you got left. So what you got? They finally learned to talk back. <laughs> <laughs> We're actually trying to make Gungaga mushroom soup. What do you think we should use? Any advice would be great. Hmm. At the risk of stating the obvious, you'll need some quality Gungaga mushrooms. Or better yet, some Maganga mushrooms. They'll take that soup of yours to the next level. Maganga Things go on a hill near here, but unless you got one hell of an eye, better to rely on a chocobo. They're flavorful suckers, so three caps ought to more than suffice. Pick them one at a time, though, if you want to keep your bird from getting all addled. Their aroma can be mighty powerful. And be mindful of the beasties, too. A lot of types are awful fond of the mushroom scent. Gotcha. Ah, and you can't forget the salt. Nothing brings out the flavor better than a sprinkling. And Magunga mushrooms being what they are, you're gonna want to savor it. Proper kind of salt for it's got a color close to this. Melon, you get them where they need to go. So we're following Melon again. I'm known to guide you to the salt deposit. Sure. Uh, I guess I should like not let him get hurt. Don't hurt enough anyway. Give you a problem. Let's call my chug over here. Go then. Upper. Friend, okay, then. Slightly owned. I'm just sniff a bit here.
I haven't seen anything that requires almost like I don't think I've ever seen anything that requires that particular material yet. On you. Why don't you leave the way? Hang back. You ready? I always forget to check the steel tables, always, I often, I often forget to check the steel tables, I should say, always. different colors let's see well one of these auto match Torkin's picture review the sketch Torkin has provided with the with left because I'll want to take a close look save to go with positive similar shape and color in mind first salt right that's obviously this one I mean, it's obviously this one. What a gorgeous color. Almost feels like a waste to grind him up. Okay, there's more. More you say. Uh, where else would be more than in this area? Chuck Run. Run. Like the wind. Oh.
<laughs> I did left it. I need all of them? Why is it alive? I mean... Get off the bird. I'm going anywhere, so I guess I gotta take all of them. on the Chogu. Okay, here we are. Here we are. That's another one. I'd say that's the one we want. Don't say. It. Further this way, then. Here, I guess. I'm guessing. Just keep guessing, don't I? Oh, no, 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 that's not. A second thought. There's a material. Now, next up are the Magunga mushrooms. Torkin said we'll need a chocobo to sniff them out. Right, where is that then? Let's try this. Magan Hill. This Magan Hill. Searching. Where was it again? All right, let's head to Torgan's. Torgan's farm is. If we can. Quickest way to some Magunga mushrooms is to get yourselves a chocobo and ride on over to Magon Hill. Where the heck is Magon Hill? Okay, so it's somewhere there, I guess. I gotta go through here then. Towards the airstrip. It does take a lot of build-up and it's easy to get hit while you're doing that, but still, it's so strong. The recommended levels, levels are somewhat catching up to me now. Seriously. Take the lead. Oh, okay. Got you. 
Using all our MP2 boost spell blade. I wonder if we're actually gonna lose Aerith before this game is over. First, to that hill, perhaps. It makes sense. It seems like we're going up. Go here. It seemed to be a path upwards. This was supposed to be a hill. It's a gone hill. Must be the area Torgan was talking about. So we're gonna need a chocobo to search. Do you have a chocobo to search? Fungi requires not only green thumb but a delicate touch as well. This is the five of each portion of the mushroom with left directional stick. The portion with the most give should be tugged first, and the portion with the least should be tugged last. Find the correct order to cleanly pluck the mushroom from the ground. Tug or two. Cancel. Alright. Mushrooms. More of them around here somewhere. Okay, back to the birds. Um, guess I should. Oh, it's a tower right about right around the corner here. Let's go to the tower first. If I can get there. That is. I guess it's somewhere. It's really, really high up. I suppose it could be. It seems like it is. To be honest. So I managed to dig in the right place at first from the first try. That's unusual. Go. 
I'll move around a bit. The tower should be out of the channels. Is it? Can we get up there? Seriously? We're gonna be able to reach it. I seriously need to bounce up there somehow? Honestly? Them. We have the tower just to unlock more stuff so I can have them in the map. It's a little quicker. Actually, alright. Seriously. Let's go up there then first. That's the rush room I should take first of all, and then the other one hopefully come naturally. Now that this is, but I wanted to get the tower. So let's see that location here. Yeah, nice. We're in dangerous territory now. Velociris. Detected nearby. Commencing guidance protocol. Farmers have long employed the Velociris as a source of agricultural labor. Sadly, the beast's numbers have dwindled over time. The time. And in the chaos following the Gungaga reactor accident, the few remaining Malosaurus escaped and went completely feral. Although these herbivores tend to have a rather calm disposition, some have been spotted traveling in herds and attacking other animals. This change is likely due to Mako exposure, and I suspect it's only one of many abnormal developments. Please exercise caution during your investigation. Pressure just using certain attacks. They will begin to heal themselves with constraints where their stagger off just gets high. It can only, but this can only be interrupted by hitting them with too powerful events. Oh, Fire, stop it! Right. Let's do a. There's not pressure in there. Come on, do it! Coming! Go on! Stop that! Two powerful offensive abilities. Let's do a dive kick then. even like getting all the objectives doesn't even matter I have no clue I'm fast travel here now so that's nice let's go back the other way then bird 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 where do you want to go birdie where do you want to go birdie oh here is a yeah. 
way off. Well, nice restoring samples. Another one of these. Cluster. Oh, get the tower first, I mean. I believe this should get me the tower, I hope. Oh, no. Hold on, how do I get to that stupid tower? Another mushroom for me to bounce on somewhere, probably. As far as I can tell, I can't climb up there. Unless that's something I'm missing. Oh, there's a bridge over there, okay. Well. See what the are up I mean, let's Google? do the Moogle first. I'll buy stuff. If there be anything new that's useful. See how hard this. Uh, I've been getting progressively harder, I'd say. Hopefully, this one be, will be not super Please bring back hard. All the yes, yes, for yes, me, yes, 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 yes. Fuck taking you. It's taking due to a new time limit. And the Mooglets are more... And the Mooglets are more mischievous than ever. Return the wall to Mooglet before time runs out. Or the game will end. Right. More mischievous than ever, you say. One at least, that's good. Really somehow? No. Oh. They can fly away then, okay. Good to know. Okay, two. Well, we've got a fair amount of time left, what's this? Yes, don't want to run out of those. I'm assuming. Right, two more. There's gonna be more, for gathering all the mooglets, Koopa. More, uh, After time Mark and Matt once. established the very first Moogle Emporium way back when, their seven children went on to open up branches all over the world, Koopa. Oh. Heck. That was weird. Got no audio now? Hmm. My 
I know like which it. would take a page out of their book. <laughs> I'll save the stream a couple days ago without any problem Thanks for at all. Coming to our Moogle Emporium. It's kind of funny sometimes how it works. Uh, yeah, let's get level boost material. Sure, why not? Way of the Fist. And four. Fortunes Untold. Level 43. Nice. Well, I'm not gonna spend any other except for Feel those. Free to drop back anytime. anytime, you say? So where was I? Um, no, that wasn't the tower. The tower's over here. thing I was trying to get to, that's why I tried to get up there, get up there. Sidetracking it, uh, like... Mm. Is it hard to... Hard to get some of these... Towers. With these two towers. It slants upwards, so that's perhaps promising. Perhaps. Something around here. No. Nope. I'm blind. Just need to go on that one. Ah. It's also a lot of owls. Just to take those towers, but I have to get to them. So I go over here, perhaps. It's down again. Alright, let's do the quest instead then. And just not to do that right now, the tower activation. I mean, we be getting to them at some point anyway. and then I immediately get sidetracked. So that's how my brain works. Very sidetracky brain. Intel. The village of Gungaga lies at the heart of the 
human jungle where many species of moss, fern and mushrooms thrive. People have a long tradition of self-sustenance, growing only produce and raising only enough livestock to support their collective. Though the village is by no means commercially enterprising, the Gangaga mushroom endemic to the region is renowned for its rich aroma and commands a high price. Gongaga's fortunes took a turn for the worse following an explosion at the nearby Mako reactor, though much of the jungle was temporarily declared a disaster area. Due to its elevated position, the village itself escaped the worst of the fallout, a small mercy considering the devastating devastation brought below. I will be going up there and see if oh, I saw a mushroom, a bouncy mushroom up there. Bouncy shroom. Well, that will take me. Just let me skip these things here. Oh, bounce. Materials, I should say. I got that one as well, let's get that one out of the way now, that's something. Dig. Sniff. Try it out. See if we can actually manage to see the give. We have four this time. I believe it is. Eight and four. Oh, okay, one, three, four. Yes, one. Should be right, I think. Sensational picking, Mr. Merc. <laughs> like a little celebration there. Go. Let's use the chocobos to find the last mushroom. Yeah, I figured it would be bouncing off here. We will be bouncing off there. Ooh. Sometimes going too low is, is kind of hard. This is just mushroom bouncing, which I done that before I started trying to for that tower. I mean, things a little easier. Oh, 
is on you. All set. <laughs> Right, let's find me that mushroom. The third and final. Right, so this one has five, I guess. So. I'm guessing it's like one, two. That's hard. This and then that and that. Okay. Two. Um, this, that, that. Let's try that instead. Broken or not, it all tastes the same, right? Ah. Uh, but, 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 but. Sure, it was that way. That oh, well. should be it for the mushroom. Yep. Oops. But, 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 but. Perfect mushrooms. Not load now, can I? It's like six minutes ago. Save here and try loading it and just see where I am. You gotta save data. This one. Oh, that's fine, I guess. I teleport down here? No. That is fine, I guess. I want to get that mushroom correctly for both of them. Annoying that I managed to fail that. Let's go up here and jump down again. Play just to get a perfect mushroom, hopefully. I'd say hopefully get a perfect mushroom because it's, it's no guarantees. Don't hold back. Take the lead. Okay. Hey, quick up. So long. Can you take over for Hang me? Back. Shirt like that, right? Sensational picking, Mr. Merck. Thank you. I am quite One pleased with myself. Go. Let's use the chocobos to find the last mushroom. Fight and save, and then. Uh... Gonna finish it quick. Don't 
overdo it. I'll take care of them together. Coming. Good night. That's the way to do it. Busy, got you. So long. It's your turn. My turn. <laughs> <Run>. <laughs> This time I will be saving beforehand, just I don't wanna the third do that again. Let's not mess this up. On a perfect one. I'm greedy. I think it's this one first. And this one. Probably this one, this one, and this one. I'm guessing. Durability this one either. It must be this one, right? And then this one. That one and that one. Both be right. Think you got a future in farming. Ah. After. That should be it for the mushrooms. Yep. Looks like we're done. Done. Let's get this stuff to Cisne. I'm gonna have to turn into Cisne and then be done with this uh, whole episode, this recording here. Oh, it is an episode, basically, but. Welcome to Gungada. Ain't nothing tastier than torn and thrown. What do you want from me? More heat? Is that it? <laughs> Calm down. Enjoy your new home in the trash can. Am I ever gonna get this right? Uh, let's uh, give her the ingredients. We come bearing have. ingredients. Why don't you give it one more shot? I can pitch in too. Well, since you guys went to the trouble. Okay, one more shot. Just one more shot. <laughs> Check something out here. inviting me over for dinner thought I'd be nice and return the favor by making them poison apparently <laughs> but as you can see I'm a sore loser cooking's never as easy as you think got that right didn't need to learn back in Midgar the company provided all our meals tasted like garbage though don't know how I stomach the stuff that bad huh <laughs> but what about the bomb berry flavor Bomberry? What, like the military rations? Yeah, those. Uh, sorry, that's really not important. Uh, what is important is the soup. The soup! Time to taste test! <laughs> Whoa there! Might want to let it cool. Right. Oops. That's pretty good. I mean, you it's haven't played Crisis Core. I don't know who she is after perfect. all. Perfect. I just know the fairs are gonna love it. Great job. <laughs> Chocolate soup. Nice. Yeah, pretty good. Ah, uh, now what else did I get? I think I got something from the other quest. What was that? Accessories for life, I believe. Right. Speed Demon Keychain. Isn't it? That's gonna focus. 
There's no luck, lucky amulet, right? Next, like 10 luck I got from that one. And then we had the... Chakra earring, but I kind of know what chakra earring does naturally. Or could actually be pretty useful, to be fair. Well, that is it for a lot with this one then. Let me just... Uh... unlocked any more of those mushrooms or mushrooms but capture our stuff i wonder if it's like after maybe like after you're done with uh, or when you get back there i suppose could be a thing i went back to grasslands and buy, buy myself a card as well Now I gotta try to get to those stupid towers. I wonder why it's so hard to get to them. This one and this one. I did kind of try to get to those after all. Perhaps we go here, maybe it's easier to get to this one. Perhaps. There's the sneak spot. And one more tower. Have a reactor. Neat. Right, well, like I said, that's gonna be it for this one, so I will be doing that stuff that I was talking about in the next one. But why oh, I should ah, let's, let's not do the Let's not do the uh old the, the, the uh hard purchase right now. I did finish off Kujat a couple of recordings ago. Um, but yeah, like I said, that's it for this one. Until next time, have a good time.